Hey guys, Silent Sale here. Welcome back to another Utah Macross update video. So this video is mainly talking about what has been added for the um, fourth anniversary celebrations for Utah Macross. As you can tell, certain things have been added onto the home screen, or rather, it's just one tiny tab right here. So that's the first thing we're going to talk about which is the brand new bingo missions that we have to clear if you want to claim all the wonderful rewards here so as you can tell um, each section has its own rewards as you can tell from the icons on each slab so there are actually bingo connection rewards as well so like if you complete the entire card you gain of course the guaranteed 5 star bingo ticket which is fantastic so you have to clear all the missions to claim all of these wonderful rewards here. So as you can tell from this section, on the top right hand corner, it's only the first bingo card out of three. So you only get to see the other two once you've completed them. So we're gonna go through each of the cards um, as I clear them. So <laughs> hopefully I can clear them as quickly as possible to let you guys know what the next um, card basically requires you to do. So the first mission is instantly clear because my player rank is above rank 8 which is what you need um, to clear that particular slab right here. So the next one um, basically just needs you to play an event song once so that's pretty easy to do uh, if you are actually playing the event and not slacking off. <laughs> Alright, next thing, um, basically, yeah, um, so the daily songs, so if you go into the live section, of course, um, there's these event songs that you can play to gain materials um, under the event tab. Play it once, you will clear this instantly, hopefully this helps you out, and hopefully not many of you guys are stuck on this one, because you are too busy grinding the event that you forget to clear those event songs that can give you the also important re uh, rewards of materials um, that you need to power up the episode plates that you've been getting from all the daily free pools so yeah and of course um, this one requires you to pull a total of five gacha um, so inclusive of the 10 episode plates it states here that the 10 gacha pool is considered as one count so yeah, you have to pull 5. So every day we are given 3 free daily pools, the single pools. Then of course you've got the free template pool. Then of course there's another current discounted gacha that's currently going on. We'll talk about it later. So if you do pull it, it'll end up being 5 straight away. So that's fantastic. So this one requires you to score uh, 300,000 score and above. So if you guys have been trying to clear the um, summer ticket missions that requires you to do a 10 million score, this should easily clear. Um, so yeah. Then of course the star or rather the uh, zodiac medal um, just need to attain 500 of them. So this one's pretty easy if you've been playing the event you surely get it done. Alright, so um, the next one, Cho Utahime Mo, activate once, no problem, uh, should be fine. This one, um, what? Plate? 30 pieces? Okay, so this is gonna be a problem to attain. I guess if you've been pulling template gacha pools, this one shouldn't be that difficult. To clear so unlike for us who are free to play um, this one might take a few days <laughs> so if you count today's 10 plate pool um, and of course the three daily free pools it's only 13 plates a day so you definitely need at least three days before you clear this bingo card so yeah that is if you're not planning to spend any money to purchase singing stone packs and pool template gacha pools, that kind of stuff. Alright, so next one, Uta Macross uh, login for the next two days consecutively. Hmm. So it seems like the bare minimum you need to clear this entire card 
bare minimum, and I'm talking about free-to-play conditions, is just three days for the first page. So if you're looking to clear the next two, uh, I guess I'll see you <laughs> in the next two days or so. Um, depending how fast I can clear all these. So I wonder if this particular one um, accumulates through the free event gacha. Uh, no, no, not event gacha. I mean event episode plates that you can attain from playing the songs. Uh, if you're lucky enough to attain some episode plates, this one might clear faster if it includes it. That'll be interesting. Alright, so bingo missions, first page concluded. Let's move on to the next thing we need to talk about, which is here under the event missions, Basara's birthday mission. So, pretty straightforward. If you guys have been following me on Facebook, you've probably seen my translations on the birthday missions every so often. Um, right now, Facebook is down, so those of you who are following me on YouTube, please follow me on Instagram. Um, link is in the description down below. I usually um, update such missions on Instagram now because Facebook is down. Um, so yeah, since I'm putting this information on YouTube through this video, I won't be updating Instagram about the missions, so you guys have to check out this video again if you want to reconfirm what you are uh, uh, have learned through this video so the daily mission requires you to have Basara as your center position diva or uh, performer because <laughs> Basara is not a diva um, and then of course clear the song Seven Moon and usually in the live event tab you will have the birthday exclusive song there so you can use that uh, apparently ever since Dana updated the game the requested song 7 moon can also be the regular version in the Macross 7 tab so yeah that's pretty fantastic if you're trying to gain that 10 million high score all right then of course the regular mission requires you to have Basara as a center um, character in your setup and of course you can play a total of five songs so you can just skip ticket through this entire mission and you receive the exclusive Basara birthday cake so do take note since the event is for well technically three days 14 15 and 16 um, you need to clear the daily missions every day so make sure you just have Basara into your center position um, to clear a song and you should be fine. Uh, usually the last day of the event is fantastic because it gives you extra skip tickets so that's always good. If you're wondering what the second gift is, well it's Basara's Kiawawa dolls if you need to power up Basara's costumes. That's always welcome. Alright moving along, the other mission that we need to talk about as you can tell there is a new one. So the Rare Up Star missions have now given you a whole bunch of stuff to clear and sadly to say this one requires you to do full combos so everything's exactly the same it's just that you have to scroll all the way down and you can see the total requirement um, is 50 full combos so yes get good play <laughs> the hardest difficulty or rather technically the easiest way out is play the easiest difficulty song full combo that song 50 times you should be fine yeah and um, skip tickets don't help with this so gotta work hard <laughs> for your rare up star fragments all right so i think that's about it on the missions so how do you guys do for the summer ticket i'm still try struggling for the 10 million high score uh episode place is really the key factor uh, aside from setup so yeah okay so the last thing we really need to talk about is actually the gacha um, so there's a new banner here if you notice so we return to the 1DW gacha gacha I'm fumbling it's late in the night <laughs> I want to go to sleep and yeah uh, so the 1DW gacha basically is uh, once per day 50 stone pool for two episode plates um, so that's always fantastic hmm 
So it actually gives you a 4 star and above chance. Guaranteed actually, 4 star and above. So looking at all the episode plates they've been flashing by so far, the place they've been introducing has been really fantastic ones. So this one is combo bonus and it comes with the item note attachment. And of course we have Shadows, um, no special notes, but this one is pretty good because it has the mode score up life skill. So pretty decent um, for Milane. And score and damage, they're pretty okay considering that if you need a slightly better blue series episode plate for your 10 million high score achievements, it's a pretty decent plate. It's not the best total, but still pretty decent. Min Maze, um, very good total score. Oh, score improvement. Mm. So Min Maze plate is definitely the one to look look out for, inclusive of the Reyna and Freya episode plate. At just the cost of 50 Singing Stones, I think it's a pretty good steal. So with this tutorial video, or rather update video, I'm gonna pull the new gachas as well. So this is a s update slash gacha video. So you guys are gonna see. So today also starts the brand new costume points episode plate gacha as well. Um, this one definitely guarantees you a four star and above. But I think it's just a single plate. So single plate, um, double plates, and ten plates. So that's. Uh, let's see. This is. 2, 1, 3, 13 plus you know 3 daily free pools so that's quite a lot already very close to the halfway mark um, so yeah so as you can tell my free daily pool is from yesterday's night <laughs> so I've not done it yet so let's do this first um, so this will include into the one free pool so I will have 4 free episode plates today uh, that's fantastic if you're trying to clear the bingo card. So, yeah. Okay. So, it's a pretty common episode plate considering that it just reached the double digit mark. So, I'm not really expecting fantastic stuff um, this time around. So, let's go with the um, costume points gacha first. I think most of the costumes that was featured I've already unlocked, so it's just gonna be additional costume points for my episode of collection. Mm, that's always depleting. <laughs> oh, so yeah, it's a guaranteed 4 star. So yeah, it did not evolve to its 5 star form, but still. Okay. Alright, seems like I get to evolve this costume plate. Not like it matters. It's just giving you extra points. Alright. So let's try out the 1DW gacha and see how things goes. Okay, we're spending 50 singing stones here. Although technically I should be keeping my singing stones for the upcoming gacha. I just hope I have enough <laughs> by then. Here we go. Alright. Three Valkyries. We do get a guaranteed four star plate though. So it could evolve. Alright. That's not what we are here for. No evolution, but that's fine. It's two episode plates for the cost of 50 singing stones, which is basically the cost of a single pool. So that's a pretty good deal. Oh, I got enough points to unlock um, Kaname's costume apparently, so that's nice. So at least I got something out of this um, one new costume to the wardrobe, so that's fantastic. Okay, so let's go ahead with the template free pool, free pool for, <laughs> for today. <laughs> Um, to be honest, I've not gotten anything fantastic since the introduction of this gacha. Uh, guys, let me know 
if you've got anything fantastic, well, except for that one time that I did a video for Gacha and I got something out of it, but still not that fantastic. Okay, we got a red box. Yeah, that's it. So as you can tell, the free template pools are just there to you know be generous, but not that generous <laughs> in some ways. I I've seen lots of people on Twitter um posting about their free pools and a majority of them have not gotten anything fantastic. I mean some have got lucky, some even got two six star episode plates from their free pool, you know, depending on each account. So you know, each account has their own luck period. So mine just happens to be at the start of the month for this time round. So next month I expect it to be dry as the Sahara Desert. <laughs> okay. It seems like my microphone is still echoing. I have no idea why. Hmm. Okay, so I think that's it for all the gachas we have today. Technically you can um push forward with your bingo missions with the super dimension gachas as well if you still got tickets for it. So that's one way to push forward. So anyway guys, that's it for today. Um, that's all I have to update you guys on the missions, the bingo card, and you know, um, the updates on the gachas as well. If you guys feel lost, why are there suddenly so many new gacha banners? So make sure you go ahead and pull all those free stuff. Don't waste it, it even though it might technically screw up your luck for the month. But you know, Free stuff is always welcome, especially for new players or free-to-play players. Um, but that's it, guys. Anyway, guys, I'm going to head off to bed. I'm going to pop some medication, sleep, rest it off. And I'll see you guys in the next gacha video for Ranka's Reina costume. Oh god, I'm not looking forward to it. It's just, it's just looking strange for me, personally. <laughs> anyway, guys, see you. Bye!